what is up ladies and gentlemen my name is varun gupta and this is it's everything man i hope you all are safe at home and getting things done in today's video i'm going to tell you how to gain weight or let's just say how to gain muscles and tone your physique because i don't think there's anybody who wants to gain fat more than muscles so there's two things we're going to be focusing on when it comes to gaining muscles nutrition and your workout firstly we're going to talk general things why you're not gaining weight there can be many reasons why you're not gaining weight but firstly i would like to remove the myth from most of the people's mind which is going on and that is making an excuse that their metabolism is very fast and they digest food very quickly see there's nothing like that the only difference between you not gaining weight and the person who can gain weight easily is the amount of activity level he is doing throughout the day there's something called maintenance calories surplus and caloric deficit which i will come to in a minute but first remove this thing from your head that you not going to gain weight because your metabolism is very fast so the number one reason in my opinion that i have seen with most of my clients that struggle with gaining weight is that their activity level throughout the day is much more than the one who is able to gain weight very easily and they don't even realize that they don't even know that they are much more active than an average person that is the only reason that they're not gaining weight and i think quarantine has already cleared this misconception from most people's mind because we are not doing anything and that is why we are able to gain weight now people who are this skinny are able to gain weight now people who are this skinny have a little bit of fat on their stomach and that is the only reason that you were not able to gain weight before your activity level was too high so in order to gain more weight in the form of muscles so that your body looks more toned follow these things which i'm going to be telling you in this video you have to eat enough in order to gain weight now what do i mean by that let's say this is your caloric tank for the day this is the amount of calories you need to maintain your body weight and this let's say is 2000 now if you are burning 2500 calories throughout the day what's going to happen is you're going to lose weight because at the end of the day there is minus 500 calories left in your tank minus 500 calories will be removed from your tank on everyday basis until you remain on the diet which has 2500 calories in it the moment you burn only 1500 calories on everyday basis you are left with 500 calories on everyday basis at the end of the day in your tank what this 500 extra calories is going to do is convert into weight there's nothing except this which is going to help you gain weight or lose weight now this can be done through nutrition very easily which i'm going to explain now so why do you think the salad diet the fruit diet works for most of the people when they want to lose weight because salad has less calories in it it has way more less calories than your legumes your let's say avocado pizza weight loss in that scenario happens because those are very less calorie foods so in order to gain weight what you're going to do is eat caloric dense foods this helps with people who have very less appetite this is another reason why you are skinny why you are unable to gain weight and appetite is the reason that they feel full their appetite is much lower than most people so what they have to do is include dense calorie foods in their diet what kind of foods your nuts your ghee peanuts your peanut butter flax seeds your sunflower seeds chia seeds a middle class man cannot afford avocado in india i never had avocado in my whole life you know why because same kind of nutritious value can be gained from different foods if you eat chicken you fry it you eat eggs you fry it with oil you make egg bhurji scrambled eggs you fry it add ghee in it eat mayonnaise eat cheese eat paneer these kind of food items are dense in calories they have way more calories now if you want to just gain muscles and minimum fat little bit of fat will be gained in the process of gaining weight you cannot just add muscle to your frame i wish it was that easy but if you want to minimize the gain of fat 
and just add muscle to your frame you're gonna have to measure your calories this is the best time to do so get in the habit of measuring your food all you need is a measuring scale 150 rupees i'll put the link in the description which i use if you go to your trainer he'll directly tell you mass gainer is the best option for you but do not listen to him mass gainer is just dense calories i just told you you can get those amount of calories from different foods make a mass gainer shake like this all you need is two bananas one cup of oats milk peanut butter coffee and this one is an optional protein shake just put all of these things in a mixer grinder and just grind it what comes out will be a thick shake and that is your mass gainer shake now if you want to gain muscles and if you're a vegetarian Vegetarian protein shake is a necessity. If you're an vegetarian, eggs are fine. Eat them. It will definitely help you gain muscles. And if you're gonna add protein shake to it, it will just give you a little bit of edge because quality protein is already in your diet, unlike vegetarians. Now, if you're a non-vegetarian, you don't have to add whey protein in your shake. That's fine. Don't add it. This is just high in calorie shake. Rest of the diet throughout the day matters as well. Remember what I told you about the tank? The leftover calories in your tank should be measured at the end of the day. So this particular shake or let's say mass gainer shake is addition to rest of the foods you eat throughout the day. So I advise you, you eat this meal at the end of the day before you go to sleep. Because if you eat during the day, you're not going to feel like eating anything else. Your rotis, your usual meals during the day. And then you're gonna come back to square one, not eating enough in order to gain weight. This was the nutrition part. Now coming to the workout part. Yes, you will have to do some kind of workout if you want tone muscles, if you want to add muscles to your frame. And by saying workout, I don't mean running. You're gonna have to do some kind of resistance training, be it calisthenics, your body weight training, be it training with weights, be it combination of both. Resistance training is important. You break your muscles when you do resistance training, you come back home, provide the right nutrition, take the right sleep, your muscles get repaired, bigger and stronger. And if you're a beginner or intermediate, start with three to five days of working out. It doesn't matter if you do not have weights, just buy a resistance band or just do body weight exercises. They will also help you get a kickstart in the world of fitness or in the world of resistance training. So the summary is you have to eat in a caloric surplus. You have to eat enough in order to gain muscles. The only reason you're not gaining muscles is because you're not eating enough. And if you want to gain muscles and not just fat, you're gonna have to do some kind of resistance training. Mass gainers are just a waste of money. Don't invest on it. That's it for me in this video. If you like the video, give it one of these and let me know. Varun, keep producing content like this. I like your video, man. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you never miss content from me. If you have any specific video request, do let me know in the comments down below. Or you can hit me up on the Instagram. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.